You're watching Inside Yellowstone. If you're pressed for time or like to multitask, you can visit both Yellowstone Lake and the geysers and hot springs of the park at the same time. Go to West Thumb Geyser Basin. Located along the southwestern arm of the lake, West Thumb provides visitors with both a view of the hot waters of the park as well as the immense cool waters of the lake. The short half-mile boardwalk trail allows you to look down on some of the deepest and most beautiful of Yellowstone's hot springs and then turn around and look out over miles and miles of blue lake water to mountains on the other shore. The west thumb of the lake is a bay created by a volcanic steam explosion 162,000 years ago. It formed the small caldera which later filled with water creating an arm to the lake that is 300 feet deep. The west thumb caldera is a small caldera within the much larger Yellowstone caldera. If the small bay formed violently, its small geyser basin packs a punch too. The West Thumb Geyser Basin is home to all four types of thermal features in Yellowstone. In addition to small geysers and gorgeous hot springs, there are also steamy fumaroles and even mud pots. Some of the features extend out into the lake, and when the water is low, they peek out above the surface. Some create pockets of open water in winter when the rest of the lake is ice covered. Otters enjoy this. One of the thermal features on the edge of the lake is the famous fishing cone, otherwise known as the hook and cook, where early visitors could catch a fish in the lake and then dip it in the hot cone to cook while still on the line. Fishing in the area is no longer allowed and visitors are asked not to put anything into the thermal features. For summer services, visit the lodge, stores, and restaurants nearby at Grant Village. There's a campground, boat ramp, gas station, and visitor center with a fire exhibit. Grant Village is named for Ulysses Grant to honor the president who signed the bill creating Yellowstone National Park in 1872. Grant and West Thumb offer visitors access to fascinating thermal features, the beauty and serenity of the lake, as well as a chance to visit a caldera within a caldera. It's a wonderful display of the Yellowstone volcano's diversity.